let's start so today uh, we are going to explore dean date and time api okay. and yesterday uh, we have a uh, learn uh, almost lots of uh, classes uh, which uh, java given us to use like we have learn a local date class okay right uh, local date class date means key just uh, return the your local date and uh, you can just use local dot now though they will give you the your okay. so this is the way we, you can uh, make the local date as a current date name. So yesterday we understand the local date and sometimes this is the only date, right? Right. And, but this is the, the date, which is the very basic format, right? Right. Uh, yesterday Seki, we need to understand, can I change this format? I don't like this format, right? Right. Maybe here, because 11, not, yeah. I want it should be like a number or it should be like a two is the November, or I confuse. This is the month, or this is the month, right? Right. I'm confused. But as we know, okay, today is the second November, that means this is the month, or this is your date. Might be someone say, this is year, this is the date. Might be someone say, this is the year, this is the month, and this is the date, right? This is right. confusion. So sometimes, this is the by default, uh, whenever Java designers implemented this API, something they set by default, right? right? And also expose, if you want, in your different uh, uh, pattern to read, you can do, right? There is not hard and fast. Whatever the, sometimes you say, you know, I want first uh, date, then month, then year, right? Any, right. any pattern, each uh, country, each person, each location have a different uh, styles of writing dates, right? Right. So let's see how to do date. So this date class have an option like uh, format. Now you can format them, whatever the formatting you want. That's a good option. So question notice formatter is the method, but they are expecting, what expecting? You give me the date format time, date, date time formatter object. Right. So you have to decide date time formatter object. Date time formatter object. And notice this is a what? This is the simple class. So we can clearly use them. Right. So basic use, uh, this is already factory method. Like uh, uh, we'll discuss lots of patterns. Okay. Uh, already have. So you can follow. Or you can define your own custom pattern. Let us say, I am saying this is my custom pattern. I am saying my own pattern. Right. Say, this is my own pattern. I am saying here, say, and here you can define. First, you want, first, you want uh, maybe month. So you can say, I want to first month. Maybe year, you can say, I am year. I want to, after that, after that, I want to our, okay. okay? So now just you pass this formatter here, right? Right. See. Out and here say, hey, local date. I don't want to. Yes. Dot format and this is the date formatter. I pass apply, right? Right. So this is my formatted date. Formatted date. We are at least print display for date as per the my format, not the default format. So notice I am changing the format here. Okay. Yeah. Even I want to know here I want to uh, maybe slash like right here. Don't want to space, right? You can do this. Will do for you, right? Yeah. So what pattern format here? You say this will work. You can say, no, no, I am interested uh, this month uh, should be like, uh, just write 3M. 
and now instead of 11 it give you the different patterns like uh, now something November right oh okay, if you okay. want to full name you can say let's one more M and it now it's become a full name your number so depend upon your situation whatever you want right formatted right. date now due to the lots of you can say flexibility you whatever you have date dot formatter even you can write here this and here direct this code you can write inside this format method itself right right it's work and even it's okay hey i want to maybe some is instead of this i want to space don't want to anything right right so if, whatever the pattern you feel Okay, missing semicolon. So this is the we can use the date time formatter class to format your timing, right? This way. Right, right. So now you have your own control which way you want. No, you want to first should be the date. What should be the date? So you can say first would be the date and then space, then I want to month and then space in this way, right? whatever right. the signature you say compiler write date to your format right right so this is very very flexi class whatever the space you want to someone say no this is not good format maybe i say uh would be like a first like uh, this and after that comma uh maybe here here i want just this way okay so whatever the flexibility you want similarly you can define the here date Right, notice November right. 2nd, 2023. So this is a good option. By default, this is the Java given. You can change what the pattern you want, right? Right. So for formatting any date, we can use date time formatter class, right? Right. So this is the local date. And uh, similarly, uh, something this is the default pattern you can say but sometimes say hey uh, i'm going to use some standard maybe not the custom this is the custom pattern so instead of that java already given some basic pattern like a basic like iso date you want just mention the iso date pattern by default they are follow the whatever the iso date pattern right right so you can use the existing uh, java so this is the by default ISO pattern. This is the ISO pattern. And even you want to some maybe a different pattern as well as you can check lots of pattern this class have given. Date, time, ISO instant, local date, local ISO, lots of options they have. ISO okay. offset date, right? Let's option check it. So we can check explore which fit for you or you can define your own. Both have an option. Okay. It will something because offset means they need some time zone there is no timing here class right so no offset you can apply okay so here say date time local instance or in lots of options you have week date zone date iso time explore lots of options they have right mm -hmm. so something they like this way week 41 44 week right month. 44 week right this is the from the january to till now this is the uh, 44th week right so lots right. have an option they already explained and given to us so I, here i'm trying to say okay, date formatter class is just define the very flexible way you can define your own pattern or right. you can use the existing pattern whatever you want right Right. So let us say here we understand only date. What about the sometimes you understand that your class like yesterday, local date and time. I want to time as well, right? So right. local date time equal to local date time. And if you print this, will print our by default print our date as well as time, right? Right. So again, in the time, we have lots of formatting I want. This is a default format, right? This is the default format. 
Maybe right. I don't want a default format. I want to some di different format. So again, here we can say, I'm going to apply formatting. So here say, dot format, right? Right. And format and just change the format which you want, right? Now we have an option, date time formatter. You can, any formatting you can apply. Okay, ISO basic. So you can do this with the ISO basic. What is the basic format? Or uh, any pattern you want, this pattern you want, this pattern. So this is the yeah, basic ISO pattern. 2023, right. 11, 02. Maybe you want to now, uh, change, yes. right? Uh, Something the, different. In uh, in the in the form, it, does it tell like uh, what type of uh, it is looking? For? If you go to the format, right? Make, make it empty. No. In the format, yeah. You so have to pass format, tell, na? Is he will say like what it is asking yeah. for? He's passing for data format. Okay, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. He say you pass the date time format here. Right, right. And you. So here you have to decide what the date pattern you want. So okay, hey, date time formatter, date time formatter of let's see, I am defining my own pattern. So say hey, this is my pattern. I want I M M and uh, Y Y and maybe D D. After that, I want to uh, hour and want to call on minute and i want to am and pm right this is the option yeah. you can give and say this is the format format so pass the pattern right yeah so now this same date now print in that is this format uh it would be say key month m capital capital u is the probably double m okay that's the option Okay. In this way, you can say, hey, don't print this is the default format. Now, no, this is the default format. I say, no, print November 2023 to 9 o'clock, 27 a.m., right? Right. So you can give your options what you want, right? Mm, okay, so that's really useful. Because uh, even you can say, yeah. change everything. Yeah, everything. You are saying, no, no, I want to full... Uh, month name, the four time name. So they give the complete, not NOV, just November. Okay. Okay. So November 2003 to someone say, uh, no, no, this is the dot, not date. I want to look like date. Uh, first should be your DD slash MM slash YY, right? Right. I, I want this format, right? Right. This will say this format. So you can explore lots of options they have given. So this may be 2 November 2023, 9 o'clock, 28 a.m. and p.m., right? Right. That's good? Yeah. So for uh, formatting your output of your date, prefer use to date time formatter class, right? It's good? Yeah. And you can simply uh, mouse over Java documentation given a clear key of formatter or a printing or parsing date and time object. So this class you can use date time format, right? And you can use uh, some predefined common pattern like uh, UU, MMM, DD. This is a pattern you can use or any custom pattern you can use. So how to use them? Whatever the local date dot format and pass your formatter. Or even they have a not only format class, they have also you can say parse, and while parsing, you can pass the format. And right. just read the Java documentation. And even this, this is a different style they have created, right? You can use this formatter and different right. style. This is style, this is style, this is style. Only the, this is the bicycle ISO, basic ISO date, like this way year, month, date, right? Someone say right. ISO local, this means ki hyphen, 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 like right? ISO right. offset means. If you let's apply offset, means they are giving your offset plus 530 something. So let's apply this uh, here ISO, right? ISO offset. Right. They have lots of options given you. You can use the existing. 
like ISO, uh, SO, offset, offset date and time, right? Test. So same date, they can print it. Again, say what date is it, which format I have to use. So here say for, for, this is the offset date. They have offset, right? And they say basic offset, huh? this is I say, I also offset, I say, I also offset, okay. Okay, what say there is an unsupported dev roller thing say okay offset second so because we are not using the uh, offset date and time so this is the one more date and time uh offset 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 date and time okay offset dot now and just say right so this uh, if you note it's out uh Offset. offset date time, right? And just run. So my might be this have an offset means key our data object currently we have to create data object that have a complete like a date time offset. Notice here, this is the plus 530 Indian time zones, and this is your date, it's times all the things. The same you can now you can say hey, now say dot format and here say date time formatter uh, dot iso let's now test it so now it's printing right this is the of same format so now you have changed the format like only like uh one two I see the date, a date time both only the this in the date, not the time, right? Here we have a different upon the different different permutation combination. We have noticed here this only say this is your date and your offset. Offset means plus 530, right? So here just read the documentation. They give given all the kind of possible permutation combination you can try, right? Offset times, offset date, similarly, like this is the maybe you want to iso zone the time date and time so they mention here zone digitalization which is the zone right let's try right so they have a lots of permutation communities say iso zone the zone date and time so they mention uh which zone so here uh study i think remember tell you what is the offset notice here uh, yes this is 5.30 and John. Any other options we have? Uh, no. ISO, I, let me again check what the option we are looking. Uh, this, I am looking this, this, not this format like a ISO Jode date time. Okay, I have to use date and time this, I think. ISO date and time. Right. ISO date in ISO zone date in. Is it the same? But they have giving me this. I'm not, he not giving me like, so we can explore, means we can define our role, right? So, objective is like this is the class, one class, and I think uh, given. Uh, lots of permutation combination you have right whatever you want right and even they have a good option they have a given a complete documentation of what the pattern you can see just move your mouse here and here notice this is all the format already have you can choose anyone fit for you you can use them if not fit you can create your own right so you need to write this uh, um, after after uh, that name of the Class, yes. Class name dot this any variable. All the yeah, static yeah, variable, uh, right? Date time formatter dot, right? Dot, yes. And uh, here even uh, they have a concept like you can similarly say key date time formatter dot off patterns are directly. 
Uh, what the symbol you can use? This is all letter A to Z you can use or A to Z, small letter. Okay. These are the reserved letter. And what the, each word have a meaning. U for you can use the ear like this way or YY for ear representation. You can do U or Y for both. U for ear, Y for ear, right? D for right. data number. M for the a small M for month of year, like in this way. You want to this month seven zero seven or J U L a J U L Y a J. This four pattern you can print depend upon the what number of value you pass, right? Right. Similarly, D is small for date of month, right? G U Y. All the options they have given what the meaning, right? So here oh, notice okay. I pass A A for A M R P M, right? If you pass okay. A, that means they understand you have to print me. This is a time AM or PM, right? Right, right, yeah. So all the documentation they have available like H for hour. Like we mentioned H for hour or M for minute, right? You want to second, right. it's a S for second, right? So all the notations right. in this Java docs already given us, you can just use them. You want to V, I think uh, they uh, set the, I think, zone ID as well, right? V, this is the zone ID somehow. Or a small v like a specific time z z for the zone id so lots of you have option we can just explore and use them right right let's use the z here so here you can say instead of this i can say let's give my custom pattern this is my custom pattern right and I can say, hey, you can use this pattern. Just print. And here say, instead of A as well as, and just add the Z, right? So they give me some option. You can just explore possible combination, OK? Depend right. upon the situation timing. OK, Z is not option. That we so we have to explore which okay the something patterns are bracket you must be a letter count must be two for v something different place we have to write right so right. we have to explore right permutation combination they have right right so this is the very uh, good help documentation here available for which letter what the meaning right what the value number of thing you can write okay so just right. use them and well documentation created for you okay yeah so this is a very well documented this one yeah yeah that's very help okay yeah and that basically covers like what features it has yeah, date right. time for date time uh, formatter. What right. the format you can specify, they can give it, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, same thing you can use the Java uh, Google Doc, Java date formatter. Just copy, maybe in intelligent or not formatter. Just copy this class and go, hey, uh, Google, just Google and search Java Doc, right? Just say Java Doc for Java date time format, right? And you can okay. find the, whatever the latest version of Java, you can give the same which IntelliJ show you, you can same read out from here. Same thing here available for you, right? Right, right. All the patterns, all the things, all the examples, right? It's, all the, it's the same thing, what we saw. Yeah. And all the meanings of each and every characters there mentioned, right? Right. But yeah. it's easy to read here. Ha, huh, yes. Here you have big, big, bigger screen, bigger right now. So you use this or the small one? Mostly? Same, depend upon the whenever sometimes times I can go browse sometime for quickly reference. Generally, I can use this for quick references, right? And I want to okay. more detail read all. So generally go to the browser, right? Right. So this is good for your date uh, formatting, right? Yes, date that's formatting. very helpful, this one. Uh, so this is the one date time formatter class. Which are similarly, one more like a simple date formatter. Simple date formatter. This is also class, right? Same thing here, but uh, they are old classes. Nowadays, preferring you can use this, right? 
this is the thread safe class this is the not thread safe class okay so please right. we we have a uh, like uh, things okay so this is the thread safe class you can just read out here mention and you can use this preferably and simple date formatter also the same kind of things but it is a not thread safe class in the multi thread environment it will give the uh, same date can be different different whether different customer right so, oh, please, so it's not a thread safe you are not a thread safe so please avoid uh, using the this class you can use this class the, for date formatting to have a two kind of class one is the simple date formatter one is the date and time formatter so we have to use this prefer way to use Okay. So which one is uh, uh, thread set? This is the thread set. Okay, okay. okay. The second one, we need to have one. Thread safe. Thread safe. Please okay. use this. And this is the not thread safe. Simple okay. So you, you have show, already shown the example for date yeah. time format. Yeah. Okay. It's uh, not thread safe class. Safe class. Uh, okay. So prefer prefer user prefer prefer use uh date time formatter class. Right. Okay. Because this was uh, developed first and later part decided that there are some problems, some use cases then this is the developed later. Okay. Right good so this is the related to the formatting formatting is just representation of your date which kind of date you want right 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 this is the good part so till now date have a we know how to format them how to print them and what the formatting you want you can do so now let's understand uh, uh instead of discuss about this uh uh concept of standard times and local time right standard times local times time times yeah standard times are one is the local times why these terminology say the local times local time are uh, local date times are one is the means ki, uh, the which location which city accordingly your date and timing change right right so for those case handling java say uh we can manage the both so here uh complete uh earth notice our uh, as our uh, scientist is uh categorize some regions and zone right we are in some specific regions and city right in currently in our india we are our time zones you can know as a uh, Asia slash Calcutta, right? Okay, Calcutta. yeah. Calcutta is our Indian time zones. So, as per the time calculations, uh, uh, our I ISO standards have categorized uh, each uh, country, each place of the earth as a specific region and slash uh, city, you can say. So this uh, uh, this representation like uh, your Asia slash Calcutta time zones, this is known as your zone. What say? This is the say zone. What say this is? Zone. Okay. The zone consider your region slash your city. So tell we have to go and Google out, find out all the regions and city for with respect to the time zone. Right? Here lots of region and lots of city, but there are lots of region and same city follow the same date and time. So consider due to that the region slash city. Might be one region have a different city. In the case of good example, a Canada or America, the same region have a multiple city. Why? Because they have a different different time zone. Like our country, there is no different time zone like India. So just we follow region your Asia under the Calcutta city, right? So question: 
how we no one is google no ki what is the zone all the zones how our java code no so we have a strategy say this is a for java say this is written one zone id class so the zone id class which define all possible regions and city right so you say yeah. here say uh, let's available zone this is your all available zones you have right and you can iterate them and you want to print you can print them right right uh, let's key or and a string string zone colony this and you can print them you have to know what all are the zone okay if you print we can get all the available zone or you can go just google out you can find out or you can reach java api so this notice all are the zone asia slash amman right utc asia slash right. tokyo this is the one zone asia slash tokyo right and asia right. slash singapore australia slash this okay uh, america slash los angeles right yeah Pacific slash this lots of a uh, uh, zone id we have right and if you want to total available zone id dot count okay right so these are the possible uh, uh total zones as per now uh available okay so 603 zones we have right right so almost all the zones you have right so this is the zone id and second corresponding uh whenever a uh, uh, utc time happen we are given this some specific hours plus minus what the differences mean if uh, this is the our whole earth right, right. whole earth whole earth and we divided uh, some level of timing differences whenever uh, your uh, uh, sun's rays come on the earth right earth so first uh, the country like here uh, all are the like australian country singapore country are the getting first once our earth rotation happen then come on the like, indian side then come on the south african side then slowly slowly your as per the earth rotation your timing are changed right so due to that what the standard decided uh, from the they have decided one baseline from the consider as a utc times utc time or you can say gmt time right gmt right. means greenwich time greenwich mean time gmt time right so you can say ust or gmt bait meaning that means this is considered as a zero times zero time is key this is the i think uh, this space greenwich near about the uh london okay time space from here and how many uh, side this is the your plus time zone and back this is the minus time zone right so generally we are getting like india plus 530 time zones right means key before sun goes to the our uh, london greenwich time is india get ahead 530 as a morning right our earth our, our sun rays right similarly uh maybe some minus time zone plus time zone so for those one is the number representation plus 530 right uh someone right. might be know the representation what the meaning of this 530 so good options as a java ip also say, let's give a given two options one is the actual hour differences and one is the actual your name like asia slash calcutta this will give the exact meaning context okay you are talking about the asia specific canada uh, Cal calcutta time zone right that means india or something different country so as similarly our uh, java date and time api consider both things this consider uh, descriptive name as a zone and this like a number hours difference is 530 and plus 530 minus 7 plus 530 yeah minus 7 minus 780 so all these consider as your offset id what's a offset the two terminology we are is one is the zone id 
one is the offset. Both are represent the same thing, just different representation. One is the descriptions, one is the actually mathematical number. So is it clear what is the zone ID and what is the offset? Um. Yes. Uh, so, so zone is zone is the region slash city name. Region slash city name. Okay. Right. Mm -hmm. And uh, from zone, uh, let's uh, take the year uh, local date times. Local date times. And here, I think uh, uh, we have option somehow dot at zone, zone and date times. Uh, at zone, I can pass zone, I can pass zone, then I can get, I think, particular zone date times and this zone date time have option we can find out to get offset what is the offset right right if you want to find offset you can find your offset this is your offset let's just print offset what is the offset for each uh, zone this is the zone and this is the offset Oh, you have to say zone ID dot of zone. Okay. Oh, okay. So notice this is a all country have a zone of sort ID. So let me instead of this, I say this slash slash T for a space. And this is the slash T or space. Here I am say first offset. What is the offset? And here say what is the zone ID? Let's print. So here what I did, you can get your offset from any date in times. Just get the method get offset and you're getting the offset. Right. So in this way, now as a Java programmer, are able to find out all the possible zone and corresponding offset ID. So notice uh, your UTC zero zero you can say only the Z or UTC or UTC same meaning. And after that you have a, some minus time zone plus like here, ACS less Tokyo have a plus nine time zone. Means ki they are uh, plus nine hour right at Tokyo. And similarly, America said Toronto had a minus four from the that means key UTC time from London Greenwich times they are minus four hour, right? This is the okay hour so, and uh, so you are showing me this is the offset. Offset. This is the offset and this is the zone. Oh, I understand now. Okay, so zone offset is the number of hours that it is going right. up or down. Yes, less this, less. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. In this way, uh, from the Java API, we have to find out what are the possible offset and what are the zones. Right. US plus specific is a minus seven hour behind our UTC times. This is the plus eleven hour times. Right. So all country have a different different right. Melbourne's Australia have a Melbourne plus eleven hour. Ahead means in Australia, Melbourne's sun is arise 11 hours before than your standard UTC time, right? Right. Similarly, different country, ACI have a different country, different country, all these countries, 630 country we have, right? right. Similarly, like uh, here, uh, this is our country, right? this is the ACI in Calcutta. So you can say ACI in Calcutta are plus 530 is the same meaning because. Whenever we talk about time, time is the number. For for number, this is some calculation happen. If I am talking current time, our like here a 950. 
So what is the uh, standard UTC time at that time? Just we are plus 5.30, just even minus 5.30, then you can get the UST time. UST right. time, right? So whatever the our times on, on your are your local times, just this represent the number of hour you are a plus or minus with respect to the UTC time. Right. It's clear? Yeah. And similarly, like all the country you can figure out here, right? Right. So lots of the country have, okay? Anyone you can choose, anyone you can convert, right? So like American, I uh, have a lots of, uh, maybe I can just find out all the American time zone. Just let's filter out here, say. So here I just filter. Uh, I'm not printing all if uh, zone. Zone start with this, right? Okay, I, okay. Mm. You can write maybe a stream API with filter or just start with this. So I want to just print all the, uh, you can say, uh, all the American time zones. Notice? This is the, all the American uh, time zones. Notice? Huge right. American time zones. But notice all are the minus, right? Right. Because they are after our uh, UTC time, right? Similarly, you want to figure out all the stay Asia. You can say all the Asia. Okay. In this way, you can filter out, you can get a specific things, whatever you want, right? So this right. is the, all the Asia specific time zone, right? So Asia, Kathmandu, Asia, something, right? Right. All the this is our Asia Calcutta time zone, right? Asia Kabul, Asia this, Asia this, lots of time zones, right? This is Asia right. plus three hour, Asia uh, Tokyo is the plus nine hour, Singapore is the plus eight hour, right? Right. So you can say at a times we can currently, if you know this offset, okay, you can calculate any time zones, okay? So uh, whatever currently, uh, this is the zero is the UTC times. And plus 5.30 is your Indian standard time, right? And here, say, key plus 8 is the Singapore time, right? Right. If here at time, my time is the 10 o'clock, right? If 10 o'clock, that means at that time, what is the time in Singapore? At that time, what is the time in uh, London? You can calculate. If I minus 5.30 here, right? So I can find right. out UTC time. Or here, uh, 5 three or more right then right. you can get then you can plus same here you can find other times means mathematically if you know the any time zones and you can calculate the at time the same time what is the current time happening in the other region due to this your mathematical calculation right right so due to that this offset is a very important in the date and time calculation right so right. notice, let's get to currently in India. I have a 10 o'clock. Okay, so at a right. time I can calculate what is the time would be in the London, what the time would be the Singapore. I know Singapore is uh, uh, how much, how many ahead near about the three, three hour, right? There are right. five, there are eight, means key uh, two and a half, right? So if I add two and a half, means key 12 and 30 would be the Singapore time at time, right? What right. is the London time? I can just minus 5.30. So near about 4.30 is the London time, right? Right. So in this way, mathematically, you can calculate and figure out all the times in the different, different region, different, different country. So it's clear what is your offset ID and what is your zone ID. If you right, know anything, right. Java, if you know Asia and Calcutta, you can find out this. This. If you know this, you can find out this. Interchangeable. These are the generally hardly change. These numbers are hardly change. So, so, uh, so, is it like a one city for each country or uh, many cities? Many cities depend upon uh, time changes. In India, how we follow only one time zone? Calcutta. Only Calcutta. Oh, okay, okay. So 
same time you know, in, a, in a, our india have a lots of country like new delhi mumbai kolkata bangalore lots of city but all city minor differences 5 minute 10 minute second minute differences are just but we are following on average the same time zone then there is no any different time zones right but in oh. other uh, because the geographical uh, perspective uh, look the locations we are not so uh, uh, you can say uh, which country uh, is the uh, you say here the horizontal is the highest width in the case of your then they have a different different time zones but right, our right. country india like in a vertical shape right right vertical shape so we are not cover more the uh, horizontal place of the earth rotation right so okay, due to that okay. we have just cover only one time zones if our india regions is a more the uh, horizontal wind width right they cover something mm -hmm. like either like uh, maybe uh united States, america here you can go the myanmar singapore the different different time zone can cover right Oh, so okay, okay. depend upon your uh, locations of your regions the time change right right okay. why uh, uh you know uh, america have a lots of asia asia is a bigger region right right asia is a bigger region due to that lots of different different country uh, region come here right and this is asia asia i'm just searching asia all the asia part asia yeah. have a hong kong as well as all the different different uh region right this is the Kathmandu, right this is the uh, Hong Kong. This is the uh, Kathmandu again. Kathmandu have two time zones. One is the plus 545, and one is the your. This is the different something. Plus 45, right? Name is the different something, right? Right. So these names are just human readability. This is the Bangkok. Bangkok is plus seven hour here, right? So in this way, you can filter out any. You cannot add anything, you can figure out all right with all the angles. So, this offshore help us to convert date or figure out one date to another date. Okay, so now there is no confusion about the offset ID and zone ID, right? It's clear. So let's understand. So now it's a uh, clear. So now I'm going to let us uh, today the what the date I'm on to convert to find out the ut how to convert to UTC date or how to convert to a specific zone, whatever the zone you want, what the find, find out a date, what the currently date happen in the Singapore. Let's say I want to find out, right? Or what is the date happen in the UTC? So you have to do any kind of conversion. So let us example how I'll do if you let's I have a local date times local date times okay now okay, okay. and here say uh, so in this class we have a one thing is try to say key instant instance This is the yeah. safe instance dot now. So this is our UTC time. Whenever you want to do kind of any kind of UTC date, by default Java say this is your UTC times. So currently, if you find out what is the UTC time, UTC time, and this is my local times. Okay. So if you want to make your date as a UTC, you convert your date into the Notice currently UTC timestamps is 4.34 morning, right? And now here were 10 o'clock. So that means IST right. time zone is 5.30 ahead than the UTC time. So both time is currently same. If you I, if I'm talking currently, the currently time, time is, you can say 10 o'clock, 5 minutes. But at a time, Let's you are listening from UTC the same time I'm talking about the 4 30 morning, right? Right. The way from where you are listening, the from where you are looking the date, right? Right. One uh instant can be viewed in the different time zone. But the 
actual event happen on a specific time, right? That specific yes. time can be viewed in the different different way. At the times we are studying, from my perspective, ten o'clock. From your perspective, the different time. From the UTC perspective, different time. But but mm -hmm. the event is happening at a particular times. So I'm mean, like I cannot say ki I am speaking at a ten o'clock four minute. This is the one my view from the IST point of view. Might be currently you are reading you have a different time zones, right? Right. UTC have a different time. So always be consider any event happen in this world are happen one specific moment of time. Is specific moment of time can be view from the different different angle at different different region. Different different city, right? So those right. different different city, different different angle, known as your local time zone, local time, right? At right. a specific moment, the time happen that is your actual standard times or universal time. So for a specific uh, simplicity of the date and time calculation, someone say let's talk just about the UTC. Okay. So all the servers, all the softwares. Are generally preferable way to store data in UTC format or GMT format, right? Right. Why? Because once you are store data in the zero time zones, and now UTC means zero time zones, zero offset. UTC means UTC means zero offset. So if you have store data in zero offset, and your customer can go across the any world location, right? And I can find out this word location. What is the offset? What is this offset, right? And accordingly, your zero timestamp. I can plus them or I can minus them. I can get exact your local times, right? Right. So these uh, infrastructure like uh, date and times, UTC, uh, help us to easily calculations of time. It's clear. So whenever we talk about uh, standard times or GMT time, UTC time, Java consider as a class name as a instant. By default, this is give me the your not a local time. Notice here say local data and time is a different times and say instant at now they are giving the different times. Why? Because the way this API designs, they always giving me the times from the UTC side. If you run currently on your machine, you getting this is the same time. For your machine, it is the exact same time. For this local time, it's a different. Might be here I'm getting right. a 10 o'clock. You that's, are getting like, a different time. That's like a universal time. Yeah. yeah. This is your UTC is the universal time. Universal right. time. So preferable way always store diet data in any software, any application in standard fine time frame format UTC. And later, those UTC can easily convert it to any local date and time. Right? Mm. It's good. Any confusion? So this is how you develop application. Yeah. With UTC. And then. Yeah. So generally, whenever we are going to create any Java model, like we require date of birth, we require the transaction date, we require the entry date. So generally, we are using this date data types as a instant instant means we are going to storing as a utc times right i am not going to declare date of uh, date of creation date here update date data types would be let's say i'm going to create one class like a transaction okay right transaction and transaction class uh, transaction have a like a, a start transaction and end transaction start transaction start at at, at okay, what the variable? I'm not going to say key integer variable, right? Here I say no, right. I'm saying it would be instant. Okay, at what time transaction start? Okay, and similarly, right. what transaction completed? Complete completion at okay. So, whenever in your applications, you are going to store date and times 
avoid using the date class or local date times or these times. Please use this instant so that your applications are storing data in instant. The question is that okay, now we have a local time, how I can convert to the instance, right? One right. in that use the class instant. They can convert. Another options now. This is the class I'll delete. Might be I don't want to now. I want to let's see here. I say dot off and I am custom my hour like here uh, 2022. Okay, here and this is your month, uh, maybe uh, month of April. And this is your third parameter is your date, maybe 24. And here your uh, timing, maybe your uh, uh, 20 hour and 12 and 8, right? Second, okay. this is the time. This is my custom time, okay? Date and time. And if I am printing this date and time, I am printing I'm a custom date. So this date, I want to, I don't know key what is the time zone. Because this is the date and times I manually mention, right? Manually mention, but I'm not setting any date and time. Right. So if you are using this now, now is system is defined by default, get you the current time. But always in our application, we are not working on the current time, right? Sometime you are working in the past time. Sometime you can work on the future time, right? Right. Let's decide tomorrow at this time particular event happen, right? The event date with the future date. So in this case, sometime we are using not the always not using the now. Now is just used to find out currently what the update times, your current time, what currently happened. This helps us, right? But sometime you have to set our specific future times, past time, or any time. Right. Okay, good. So those cases, uh, question that now this is local date and time I can create maybe using now or using this the, our off method or even sometime you can use dot parse method, right? Maybe you are receiving some date, uh, parse method. Here you can use receiving date from the UI, from a string, right? So here you can parse method. So lots of date operations you have from where you can finally receive the date and time object question how i can convert date and time to the instant so because i want to not store in the local date and time right i want mm -hmm. to store the ftc so i can do similarly say similarly this class have a similarly simple method notice dot this is specify the zone this is the which zone and two instant just say two instant they return me instant and set me the zone which zone offset right uh, which zone id you want what is the offset which is the you have both options you can say zone id or you can say offset whatever you have right right say, let's say zone offset and i am going to standard utc just they are two dot variable so you can say now i am converting this date to the utc time zones Right? Right. And print them. Now you are getting the institution, right? So lots of conversion method already you have. Right? No, no, uh, it, this is converted, right? Yeah. So we have to use a conversion from local date to here, here to here. Sometime you have to consider your. Uh, here notice here i am declaring date but i am not specifying this date which i am specify our minute time this is the incomplete date because this here not any mention ki this time are generated in which location right what is the region yeah. what is the city which times you are talking about 22 april 24 10 hour 12 8 all are okay but this is not a specify exact which region and which regions or which city you're talking, right? Right. This time is the one perspective correct time. One perspective say not the complete times. Because from this time, I cannot understand that this times is generated at which region, which location. 
right? right. So by default, you are not specifying anything. Compiler, your system understand UTC times. Means they are assuming you are generating these times for the London time zone. So if you run carefully and note the output, both are the same date. Notice here. Right. 2010, 2010, 2010, right? Right. So if so generally, whenever you are working about this actual times and time change vary, please consider according with the times your offset uh, zone as well as the best option uh, for this. You can use the uh, zone uh, date and times. You can use this class. Now, that by default consider date, time, zone, right? Right. You can do this way. Okay. This is the preferable way. When you are going to develop application, that application is time specific. And also, you are specific to the consider a specific region. Notice, they have considered this is the date and times of the Asia and Calcutta region, right? Right. So now you can say now this is the complete times. So at this date, at this times, at this second, at uh, you see the region where this date is generated, right? Right. Correct. And one more you have option like a uh, similarly like offset date and times. Okay. And here your offset date and times. So both depend upon the your uh, application usage uh, you are uh, developing application across the notice if you say offset they give me the plus 530 notice mm. if you get a zone id zone they give the zone name right it's clear yeah and this zone id class are this both have a given, given option you can convert from one zone data to another zone date times easily. There is no any hurdle. But please take uh, the date. If you really want to, your application date is uh, uh, date is specific application where date and times and second regions very, very vary and make important your conclusion. So please use these two classes. Okay? Because right. they have considered your local date and times plus plus your region plus plus your offset as well right right so that you, can, you are storing complete info whenever you are storing something that information must be complete right? so that in future that someone going to read them they can easily read out right and while reading right. they can decide oh, this date is for a specific location right right till now any confusion no Oh, good so let's uh, explore some methods of this class okay sure, uh, note please. they have a method uh, like uh, multiple methods uh great of zone of this class itself this class is a factory method sometime off now here they have asked to conversion if you want to convert local date uh, to a specific zone id you can pass the convert them right right this is the method you can say hey what is your local date and time you pass and second pass the zone id which zone you want to convert right mm -hmm. so let's uh, this is the uh, this is the my uh, local date means this is the our times local date times right or you can say two local date times and comma say hey i want to convert in a zone id uh, or you can say offset dot utc okay right so here you are going to converting whatever your uh, this times this is the times our australia is into the utc and they convert to and here you can print so these are very easily you can use the conversion. Just tell me this data time. This is my local times and this zone you can convert them. Right? Right. And dot two. 
स्टूडेंट इवन दिस केस क्लासेस यू कैन फॉर्मेट देम यू कैन स्पेसिफाई देम कन्वर्जन एज वेल राइट राइट सो लेट्स टाइम इज सो पब्लिक इश्योरली वी आर मे बी यू कैन एक्सप्लोर ऑल द पॉसिबल परमोटेशन कम्बिनेशन दिस जावा एट आर यू कैन से सिमिलरली दिस क्लास ऑल्सो हैव ऑप्शन डॉट ऑफ एंड यू कैन ऑल्सो पास योर लोकल डेट टाइम्स एंड ऑप्शेट विच यू वॉन्ट टू चेंज so local date times you can whatever the pass for local date times okay you can say and which uh, uh, time zone you can say zone of or whatever offset you can say utc or you can say any specific format as well right right so here just Them. I'm not going to say. So these two methods, off method here, say that what the time and which you want to conversion. You are you are getting the conversion times. Right. And now uh, we have a lots of other like uh, you can convert to two instance. No two instance you can convert. When we say two instance, by default they convert to the specific uh, uh, standard time zone. Right. Right. and similarly here even you can uh, pass your like uh, uh here ke hey i don't want to see i want dot offset off you can say here uh, like uh, uh plus i think uh, right. 08 hour right and yeah. 5 so whatever the offset you know you can specify here uh, offset valid offset okay and get the date right so depend upon the times and conversion you can use them right yeah notice this is a 10 now become a 8 okay eight hour uh, before plus right so whatever yeah. the you got a uh, utc 530 whatever the time utc 0 whatever the number valid offset you can change here right maybe i uh, want but, uh, but here the offset we need to write it manually i uh, manually or you can figure out you can figure out you have option right you know right, zone right. id thing both have option here you can pass both zone or offset both you can pass right right so these are the easily conversion whatever the time zones so local time zones convert to utc utc the locals you can get here different time zone right i am saying right. minus 7 minus 7 turn yeah and even uh, good options you have you can say here you can say even you can pass like a uh, so let's i just pass one Like uh, Asia Singapore, simple directly here. You can say here. this. No, you know already. No, so you can say, hey, I am going to say uh, zone part of uh, of a zone, and you can pass this right. And right. after that, say you can know this and say, hey, give me the. Uh, zone id and what say zone offset pass to zone offset okay zone offset you can cast them and it will really works right so lots of conversion happen you can this you can get zone id or mm. here you can already know ki how to here you already know ki how to convert your you know that this zone id uh, zone id and you can apply add zone method at zone method and you can get the zone uh, date and time and from that get offset so you can get offset right right this is the matter already know if your zone id from zone id you can convert your uh, offset method you can also you need a zone date time method class and so at zone and then you can do right right so lots of options you have and even uh, you can say like a uh, Here say a uh, zone date times uh, here a uh, dot off and your local date times whatever times you have right now right. or you can convert and here say directly I want to 
zone i have a zone already so i can pass my zone here sure here zone and dot okay also my okay also yes. my uh, uh, i have to look up to the navy so we can uh... we are we are closing it done done last one okay, okay. sure sure uh, that's done no problem we are also over the times yeah. okay so just this way you can do okay so, so here let's explore all the possible combinations you have a zone id offset id whatever you have you can do easily conversion right it will great for you, right yeah different different time zones date and time you can convert it so this is uh, with respect to the date and times and zone after let's explore them okay and if any sure. doubt any question we'll connect them sure thank you okay. Take care. Bye. Take care. Bye.